What's the name of the group that we go by? Here, right away. If they won't attack, I'm kind of like a squirrel whisperer. Oh my god, dude. Uh, I don't know. Viola School was opened in 1922, and in that sense, it's very typical of a lot of the other schools across the country because there was a huge movement in the early 1900s to get kids in school. because some people have the crazy idea, and this is crazy, very controversial idea, that kids shouldn't work in dangerous factories. I mean, who else is gonna do the work that nobody else wants to do? Minorities? Um, so, unfortunately, a lot of the country's like, yeah, minorities. Oh, so, man. it's a fucking yeah. true. They started passing the first labor laws in the early 1900s, and now these kids had nothing to do during the day. Well, what are we gonna do with uh, with kids if we can't send them to the factory and, you know, lose a limb once in a while, but more importantly, bring in a couple extra bucks for the family at the end of the week. And literally, I am talking a couple extra bucks. In the early 1900s, the, uh, the amount of schools just increased dramatically. So now we have uh, Viola School is just very typical in that regard. Hey guys, right now we're going to enter the Viola schools. Closed down back in 1998. As more and more schools began to grow, we started getting more and more technology in these small towns. They couldn't keep up with it. People are leaving the small towns. Cities are expanding, the, the biggest and the best and whatever. And so these schools are saying, hey, we're gonna have to consolidate or something. This building is in fact coming down. If you already couldn't tell, maybe you can't tell. Maybe in your realm, it looks brand new. But how do you feel that this building's days are numbered? What's that do to you? And the Ghost Crier team has came here once before and we had a, a tremendous <laughs> evidence uh, with this location. It's phenomenally charged and we're hoping to kind of repeat some of that and see uh, what exciting adventure we can have with you guys. Small school districts around the area, it might be a 30 minute bus ride for their students, but hey, we can pool our money together. And that's what uh, happened in, in Viola. 1998, the last class left. They consolidated with another district, and that's where we are. So come and join us. Everyone's up in here. Through is actually go through and just kind of give impressions of um, what spirits I might feel in different areas and if there's any new impressions that I get from locations we'll talk to that as well but I want to full disclose that I have been here before so Right now, we're going to wake the location. It's huge, as, as you can tell, and maybe you hear a little bit of reverb. <laughs> we're gonna have, there's gonna be a, uh, what's it called? 
Uh, spirit communication? Oh, yeah. We used to go to the gym in high school.